Indian Navy is taking significant steps to address its ongoing submarine shortage and aims to achieve a fleet of 24 conventional submarines. This initiative involves seeking approval from the Ministry of Defense for the simultaneous construction of all 12 submarines under Project 76. Russia made a significant offer to India regarding the transfer of technology for the Lancet 3 loitering munition. This proposal marks a notable shift in Russia's approach to defense partnerships, as it includes extensive cooperation in developing an Indian specific version of the drone. Second aircraft in the Hindustan Turbo Trainer 40 series, designated TH400 to successfully completed its maiden flight at the aircraft manufacturing division in Nashik, this event is significant as it marks the first HTT-40 aircraft produced at the HAL Nashik facility. Russia is considering extending advanced technologies from its Yasin-class nuclear-powered attack submarines to India, aiding in the development of India's own fleet of six nuclear-powered attack submarines under Project 77. This potential collaboration comes as India seeks to bolster its underwater warfare capabilities amid rising tensions in the Indian Ocean region and China's naval expansion. DRDO has launched a significant initiative aimed at enhancing next-generation aviation maintenance and simulation technology. This initiative involves the issuance of a request for proposal for the development of a digital twin framework specifically for an aero engine health and usage monitoring system. This project is part of the Technology Development Fund scheme and will be funded through a government grant in aid, emphasizing the government's commitment to fostering indigenous aviation. Technology through industry collaboration Russia has formally proposed to India the acquisition of its 3M-14 e caliber PL land attack cruise missile system. This offer aims to enhance the Indian Navy's capabilities by providing submarines with a substantial deep strike capability of 1500 km, utilizing existing 533 mm torpedo tubes. DRDO of India has embarked on the development of the Pinaka MK4, an advanced guided rocket system designed to enhance India's artillery capabilities. This rocket variant boasts an extended strike range of 300 km and is positioned as a cost effective alternative to traditional cruise missiles. India's Tejas MK2 fighter program is currently in a pivotal development phase, with significant progress being made in ground testing and subsystem integration. This summary outlines the key developments, timelines, and expected milestones for the program. Arun Ramchandani, Senior Vice President and Head of Elanti Precision Engineering and Systems, shared significant insights regarding India's procurement of medium-altitude long-endurance UAV for the Tri Services, Elanti. In collaboration with US Best General Atomics, is proposing a solution to fulfill the requirement of 87 male drones for the Indian Army, Navy, and Air Force. On 25 November 2025, the Pakistan Navy conducted a test of its indigenous ship-launched anti-ship ballistic missile, designated P-282 Smash. This missile is designed to target both maritime and land objectives, boosting modern guidance systems, terminal maneuver capabilities, and a claimed operational range of approximately 350 km, despite its development. Officials indicate that the system is intended solely for domestic use.